for this problem on the topic of gravitation, we are told that neutron stars can be rotating at about one revolution per second. And we, we know a neutron star to have a radius of 20 kilometers. We want to know its minimum mass that allows the material on its surface to remain in place during this rapid rotation. Now the extreme case is when g becomes zero. And so we can plug it into the equation we've written down, g is equal to a minus omega squared r, where g is the free fall acceleration, a g is the gravitational acceleration, and omega squared r is the centripetal acceleration. So if we set g equal to zero, we get this to be gm over r squared, which is an expression for a g minus r omega squared, meaning if we rearrange this equation, we can solve for the mass of the star. So m is equal to r cubed omega squared over g. So we know r to be 20,000 meters and omega to be 2 pi radians per second, which is a revolution per second, and g the gravitational constant, which gives us the mass to be 4.7 times 10 to the 24 kg, or on the order of 5 times 10 to the 24 kg.